Wind is nasty, isn't it? It's nasty. It wants to put this one in the same spot as the last one. It wants to blow back in the weeds again. Blows your hat off, everything. It's just a horrible. At least we don't have to worry about dealing with inlets or anything. No, in. I can't imagine what it would be like out there now. It's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Net. Well, trying to steer the boat and get the fish. There you go. You got the net? Yeah, I'll take it out of gear for a minute. There he is. He's down there. I see him. Get him? Yeah. Oh, got you him. got him. Okay. All right. I'm about Sam and Joyce, the old couple. And today we're out in the St. John's River and we're going to do some shad fishing because we can't do anything else today. We got our tra crab traps out that's blowing over 20 mile an hour, so we couldn't pull them. Too rough to go offshore, so we stopped to see if the shatter here. It's almost too rough here. <laughs> yeah, well, we're going to give it a try. At least we'll accomplish and see if they're here. You know, it's going to be like a little pain fishing. The wind blows you all around. So we'll get back to you if we catch a shad. It looks like we got the first shad or something. You got it? Yeah, I'll do it. Try it. There he is. That's a nice one. It's a real nice one. Oh, look, it came loose. <laughs> wow, you got him just in time. That's a good one. First shot of the year. That ain't a bad one. No, he's nice cooking size. For the first one. You got one, Joyce? I got one this time. You didn't lose this one, huh? No, he's bigger. It feels bigger anyway. It feels bigger. <laughs> We're catching these on our homemade uh, shad darts. They got two? What? <laughs> I, got I got two, two babies. <laughs> what the heck you got there? What are they? Huh? They, they shad? Oh. They're, look how tiny. Yeah, we caught them last year. I caught one that little. He got a double header. Yeah. Oh, they're little guys. <laughs> wonder how they'd be cooked. Yeah, yeah, I don't think they'd be much. They're more like a sardine. He went right through the net. Like a smoke them. <laughs> smoke them, yeah. <laughs> There's a little. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Prize. Yeah. <laughs> he is tiny. So you got a keeper one this time, Joe? I don't know. I don't blow away with this crap this no, wind. It's blowing at least 20 oh. miles an hour. Oh, it's awful. My hat's going to come oh, off. Yeah. Well, this is a bigger one. He's way out there. Oh, okay. Let me get the net ready. There, he's jumping. That's good. At least ain't one of those little ones. No. Here he comes. Oh, it's a nice one. Got him? Yep. There he is. Yeah, it's a nice one. Yes. Okay, we got two to cook anyway. Yeah. Let me get eight the hours away from the weeds. It's eight hours right later, we'll have weeds. we'll have a meal. Huh? In eight hours, we'll have a meal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, after you cook for eight hours, we're not gonna have it tonight, right? No. Oh no. That's for sure. Okay. A yeah, nice uh, one. A real big one, but it's a good no, size No, this one. is the perfect size to cook. Yeah, that's true. It'll make sure he's cooked good. Mm -hmm. His bones get soft. Yep. He's a big one? Yeah. Feels bigger. Yeah, it feels good. He's taking off away from the boot. Uh, here we go in the weeds. All right, we'll see what you can do, how good you are. Take, you're going to try to take a picture, and he ain't that big. He just was wild. Oh, you got him. I got him. He, he got him. He did good. He did good. Wind blowing us up in the grass. Well, we get, at least we got the fish. We've been coming every week to see if they showed up. So 
we couldn't do anything else today, and it's so we got crab traps in the water, so we couldn't pick them in this weather. I mean, oh no, we couldn't pull them in this weather. So we figured we'd go again and see if the shad are here. It looks like they're here. That's a nice one. That's the biggest one yet. Yeah, I didn't think in the water, he didn't look that big. He felt that big. Where am I going? In a circle. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> <That's good. laughs> At least I'm not going in the weeds. That's right. We're going in the circle. <laughs> There's another one. That's a nice one. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> He's lively oh, you're going to stink with your yep. clothes. These Smell things. like shad. Mm -hmm. Wind is nasty, isn't it? It's nasty. It wants to put this one in the same spot as the last one. It wants to blow back in the weeds again. Blows your hat off, everything. It's just a horrible. At least we don't have to worry about dealing with inlets or anything. No, in. I can't imagine what it would be like out there now. crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Net. Well, trying to steer the boat and get the fish. There you go. You got the net. Yeah, I'll take it out of gear for a minute. There he is. He's down there. I see him. Get him? Yeah. Oh, got you him. got him. Okay. He's in there. They're like our homemade uh, shad Wait, darts. Oh, let's don't get him tangled up. We look forward to eating these once a year. Once a year, it's like a tradition, mm -hmm. isn't it? Oh yeah. Well, if you make those cakes out, they're real good. Oh, they're great. It's almost like eating salmon. It's really canned salmon. It's really, yeah. it's really good. Well, I hope our mics are working. So blowing so hard. There. You got them, Joyce. Yeah, I got them. I'll try to keep the boat out of the weeds again. <laughs> It's a nice size one, I think. Look at him go. He's heavy. Look at him, he's great. Hey, I hope I got that. Got the net in the way. Maybe he'll do it again. I like when they jump. I don't want to lose this one. Don't lose them. There he goes. Here. Right in the sun. Yeah, I know. So we can't see him. <laughs> Here he comes. Maybe I'll make another circle. Like a king. Oh, he's a big guy. Oh, he's a big one. Oh. Yep. Get him. There he is. Got him. You got him. You happy? Yes. <laughs> you got your fish. Oh, he going, he's going to get baked. You gonna, yeah, you bake that one up. Oh, yeah. He's going to go in the oven. But he would not have lost this guy. He's really hooked. They hit these uh, shad darts because they're mad at them. They're not really eating. It's sort of like a salmon does. They actually call him a poor man salmon. I need I need my captain to get this out. Yeah. <laughs> or, or the I'll, tools. I'll get them oh wait, you. here's the pliers. I got them. Yeah. I get them. These are cheap new pot pliers. Don't get There we go. I got them. They're so slimy. There you go. Yep. Yep. Good. That's, look at that. that's, that's a nice, a nice fish. That's a nice fish. Yeah, mm -hmm. It's a fun to catch. We do this every year. We go out a couple of times and catch shad. Look how but pretty in the sun. He's doing beautiful. It for, uh, 40 years. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> One on. could get seasick out here. You're not going to get seasick here. <laughs> One could. <laughs> in, in the river? Yeah, it's looking with those big swells. Yeah, they're, 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 they're big, big swells. They're big for the river, not big. <laughs> Well, what we're catching these uh, shad on are these shad darts. And I make these shad darts now because I don't know where to buy them. So I got to mold and uh, pour them and tie this, this is bucktail hair I tie on there. And they just sort of dart through the water, you know, because of the shape of them. And the shad, they get mad at them and just strike them. They're not eating them, they're just striking them. But that's what we put them in tandem, two together. Yeah, you know, about that poor, poor. And they work good. And these ones are working good. So this has been the, I guess this, I don't know where it's caught, the, it's caught the biggest one anyway, these two red ones. But we make them in several colors, chartreuse, red, white, all Pink. different colors. They're pinkish red. Yeah, 
It's not red, red. Yeah. I don't have any red, red. That's how it comes. When you put that red on the lead, it don't come out red. I didn't give it a base. So that's how they come out. Well, let's get back in the water and catch some more. You got one on? Yeah, I got another one. It feels like a big one. A big one, huh? All right, walk up towards the bow. Wow, he's pulling hard. Yeah, let me back away from the weeds. Here he comes. Okay. Come on, jump, fish. Some of them just fight. Yeah, he's really fighting. Into the net. There you go. You're yeah, not going to hold him up in the air. Yeah, <laughs> we'll get him out of the net. He's out of the <laughs> net. She had the to one. Uh, one of them got caught. One's caught. That's all right. He's yep. out. Yeah, he's just a. Uh, and he's size. off the net. He's off the hook. He's just an average size. Yeah, but he fought. I thought he was bigger than that. Yeah. Now he bet that one that had hardly any hair on it. Yeah, the hair, yeah, the hair's pretty much gone on this one. Yeah. You pull it off with the pliers. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't nice. <laughs> I got out. Try I got... not to hook your fish. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, hold still. Oh, that's an Irish shad. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice These are size. American shad. They're not those uh, <laughs> stinky shad. They're here in the summer or year round. Oh, they smell catch. so bad. Yeah, we catch them in the cast sometimes when we're shrimping. Oh, he's These nice. Are American shad. Look at the prettiest scales look in the sun. Yeah. He's really pretty. They like those red darts. Yeah. Oh, let me get the net. It's on the other side. I see. I think I can lift him in. You think you can lift I him think in? him. Yeah. You're gonna try. We're not gonna lose. We got enough of them. Does it look like he's hooked that good? Yeah. Yeah, he's hooked good. Oh yeah, he was hooked. Somebody. Uh, they got a soft mouth, so you gotta be careful. Like That's purple. They're matter. pretty. They're beautiful. Yeah, he got him right in the sun. Yeah. He's hooked good. There you go. Now you can unhook him. I'll hold him. Oh, nice. There. Brush this one. is a crazy one. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. Oh, he got himself a fish. There, he got it. No, you know, he doesn't. He missed him. He got a little one. Try it again. Oh, he's in the sun. Now I can't see him. No, he might have missed it. Yeah. Takes a lot of skill to do this, huh? A it? lot of skill to just sit here. <laughs> <laughs> just got to get the right colors and you catch them. If you come out here and catch these, you have a sort of colors of uh, shad darts. And we're only trolling about two mile an hour. We're only in like five feet of water. These are old Penn Z series reels. They're like 50 years old at least. That's what we use. It's nostalgic fishing. They're what, right? Yeah. Yeah, they and work like nice. New condition. Well, uh oh, there's a fish. I'm missing on camera. I'll get him. You going to get him? Yeah. Let me get back here and see if I can get us out of the weeds. Oh, there he is. What's that? Little, oh, it's one of them little ones. Little guy. <laughs> That's a little right. one. Like, this is the first year we caught, we caught one little one last year. It's a little guy. Fish, Joyce. Wake up. Oh, oh. You, you want to get him? Yeah, I'll get him. You got him? I'll get him. <laughs> Just ready to take a nap. Not very big again. This is where the little guys live. You know that. That's where the little yeah. guys live. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they didn't live there last year. No, I know. There's a little one. A little one. All right, and by slowing down. Well, maybe he'll just get off in the water. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, there they're little. Them. They can poach them, maybe. You want to eat everything? I want you to just let them go. Okay, I'll let him go. Well, we're going to head in now. 
we got enough shad. I think we got seven shad. So we'll get back in. Don't get in late this time like we usually do. And uh, we'll see what Joy's going to make with them. She's the cook. So she's gonna, she says she has different ways of cooking them up. But we'll see. So we'll get back here when we're cooking them. Well, we ended up with seven nice shad. We could catch some more, but like I said, we wanted to get in at a decent time. We left late today. We came out mostly just to see if they showed up yet. So obviously they did. Yeah, they so did. So it was worth coming out, right, Joyce? It sure was. Another fun day. Yeah. Well, what we're going to do with these shad, we're going to bake them for what, Joyce, eight hours? About eight hours, yeah. That'll soften the bones up. Then you'll probably make fish cakes with them, right? Yes. We'll probably eat some. Then you yeah, make we'll make, cake, a, fish make a fish cake. We make uh, like tuna salad or shad salad. Yeah, we've done that. It's pretty good like that. And then first you got to scale them. I use this probably 75-year-old scale. <laughs> scale. It's probably older than that. <laughs> huh? Something's older than us. No, yeah. this isn't older than us. We're older than this. Stuff. <laughs> Just scale them. If you go slow scaling them inside, they don't. The scales don't go. Yeah, all usually over. we do it outside, but it's dark. It's dark. We just have dinner. Right after we scaled them, we cut the uh, fins off. We cut the belly off because you can cook it with the belly on, but we never eat the belly meat. So we can get more in the pan by doing that, and uh, cut some slits in them. So is it to make it cook easier? No, I put butter or oil in there. I got you. That's what the slits are for. You can put a piece of garlic in there, oh, onions. That's all you do. That's it. And they're, we'll do the rest of them and they're ready for the oven, right? Yep. Well, the fish are all ready to go in the oven. So, Joyce, what'd you put in those slits? Yes, uh, just butter and garlic, and the top is a little bit of salt and some pepper and some lemon pepper, and there's water, just the just just touching the the grate that's in there, and I, I put a little bit of lemon juice on the water. Yeah, this is a regular fish cooker, isn't that what it is? Right, a regular fish cooker. Yep, uh, it's got a fish on the top, so you know it's a fish cooker. <laughs> I guess <laughs> kind of cool looking. Yeah. We're ready to put the shad in the oven. You're going to set your oven at 250. You want your rack to be, well, this one's about the second one up from the bottom. These will bake anywhere from six to eight hours. And what you want to do is check them every two hours to make sure you have enough uh, water in that pan. And then that's it, and we'll see you in about six hours. The shad's been cooking for about seven hours. So they're smaller shad than the last time. So I didn't, I don't want to check them before eight hours is up to see if they're done. Uh, they look done. Yeah, they do look good. They smell good too. I'm going to try it and eat some of them bones. Yeah, this one, they must be done because this one sort of like fell apart here. Let's see. Take a nice big chunk. Oh, the meat's so moist. Look at it. Looks good. Yeah. yeah. Look done anyway. Oh, yeah. I believe they're done. Yeah, get There's the bone. You got the... Hot. It's hot. Is that the... Oh, I need that bone. Then you just put it on the plate. Yeah, but look how moist that meat is. Right there. That's the big bone. Eat that one. Get rid of that dark meat. Yeah, there's a great big bone right there. You can see all the little bones. Mm-hmm. Well, you can just eat them. Mm -hmm. They're like sardines. Yeah. Like sardines. Yeah. Right. Yep. Like this. Well, they're done. Done? Oh, yeah. They're, still they're chewing the bone up, so I guess they're done. Mm-hmm. No. So it didn't eat eight, eight hours because no. these are smaller no, shy. These were smaller than the no, we last ones we cooked. Cut the um, belly uh, out. Too. Yeah, taking the belly out. That way you can put more in this fish cooker. 
Oh, these are so good. They'll make good fish cakes. Mmm. Make everything. They're just, they don't even taste like shad. I mean, it's like unbelievable. It's, uh, the meat's like super more. Look at all the bones in there. This one's got a lot of bones. I mean, oh, yeah, look at that bone. Now you're going to eat them bones, right? Uh -huh. So you're proving it works. Mm-hmm. See? Mm -hmm. They're just soft and crunch a little, little just So six to eight hours, you figure, according to what size the shad right. are. Yep, six to eight hours. At 250 degrees, was 250 it? 250 degrees. And make sure you have plenty of water in there. So Joyce, what do you do if you don't have a fancy fish cooker like this? You get a um, either a baking sheet or a nice baking pan, line it with foil, then get another piece of foil and put the fish in that foil. And then you want to make, you want to close it up like a tent. But before you do that, you want to put your butter and your spices. Just in, like you did in, here. Yeah, just like yeah. in here. And then seal it back up and then just bake it for the same amount of time. Yeah, we've done it like that before. Yeah, it works. Well, Joyce, this American shad really looks good. And we know it tastes good because you already tried it. So what else you got to go with this shad? We got Parmesan mashed potatoes and carrots topped with uh, toasted coconut. It sounds good. So if you enjoy our videos, we'd appreciate a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And thanks a lot for watching.